So, we have to redo. Okay, so the goal is here, guys. We have to redo this backyard. So, water comes off the neighbor's house down into here. So, my idea with that is we're going to build a wall going around, a retaining wall all the way up. Cut out this hill all the way down to where Rachel is flatten this whole area out to make it more workable so it'll be like a three foot wall here tapered down this is just ideas guys i want to put a swell box here for all the water to come down into it like maybe a riverbed here into a box and then run it down out here underground so it flows out here they're getting a lot of drainage issues going down here Good afternoon. Good afternoon, boss. I'm Rachel. And I'm Carl. And you're watching Happy's Lawn Care and Landscaping. And we are about to mow our biggest property. Mm hmm Yep. This is all we're doing today. Yeah, we were farming and selling stuff at the market this mm -hmm. morning, and we had some good sales already, so... Yeah. We're off to a good start this year for yeah. the first three time weekends we opened. Yeah. But we're mowing this. This is the only one we're mowing, um... And, oh, and I'll show you guys after we mow a little bit. We went and did a quote this morning for a big landscape project. Well, we're going to do a quote. We got to come up with ideas on yeah. what to do. I did a little walk through video to show you guys. Mm -hmm. So we're going to put that up. I think Rachel told him probably August we'll be probably doing that one. But we're yeah. going to come up with a whole plan and figure it out. It's a big project. It might, so we'll see what happens, right? Yeah it's it's exciting though a lot mm -hmm. of possibilities so and with this one it's not so much plants because the homeowner she plants all her own things she kind of put things in place as rachel told me mm -hmm. so we're not going to be pulling a lot of stuff out so we're going to concentrate on probably designing a wall and patio for them more yeah. more or less mm -hmm. a usable space off the deck i think so. she really enjoys plants and and growing stuff they have a little garden and she was talking about all the little pop-up plants. So, you know, I want her to just maintain that feel that she had something to do with it. And if they want to landscape that back with their preference of plants, then, yeah. you know. They, and we can put yeah. more into, like, the wall and the patio area and the yeah. drainage that's going to have to be done. Yeah, like so I'm excited. Yeah, I'm so excited more too. hardscaping yeah. on this one. Um, which again, we would like to expand to, you know, it is difficult for people, especially because we quote things, um, we, how do I want to say this? We are very detailed yes, and we make sure that we do the job extremely right so that yes. it lasts for years and years um, and years and years yeah so when you quote to you know be able to construct something like that it's a lot of materials is basically what i'm saying yes. so we have to make sure that we're still making money but we're still able to buy the materials that are needed um so it's an investment Yes. Basically. And then when we put the quote out for the materials, like say we finish this quote in like three weeks and we can't start it till say August, maybe September, we will put in the quote that materials might change in price. Right. Um, that's about it. The laborer. Unless we like get that. a quote right away to get it scheduled, yeah. um, then we would think about going to get the materials and just at store that price them at the house. and storing. Yeah. So, and when my point is, is when you are quoting like that, not everybody understands. So when, you know, we were talking about French drains, even, mm -hmm. you know, when you get a quote for a French drain, that is X amount of dollars. And then a second quote for French drains, that is X amount of dollars times two, maybe two and a half. Um, people are like, whoa, but again, it depends on who's doing it and how they're doing it. Yeah. Some people. And the old saying, you get what you pay for. Yeah, definitely, guys. So, so that just is something that. And I we always like. tell all our clients, they can, if they have, a, if any of the clients that we have or any of the 
prospective clients we have. Mm -hmm. Question the quote. We always would tell them they have every right to go out and get two, three, four, five, six more quotes and then pick the one that you always want them to do that. So they feel like they're making a good decision. I mean, we just are very detailed in what we do. And I explain, you know, what our project consists of. So, you know, a lot of times you have to just educate the client to compare um, apples to apples instead of apples to oranges. Definitely, so, boss. Yeah. So let's get out and get this one mowed and be done for the day, guys. Okay. Oh, man, he's got moles. Moles everywhere. Wow. He's got a lot of moles. Uh-oh, really? Oh, yeah, this whole whole side's full of moles. Like what? Look how long this is, guys. It's been 10 days. 10 days. Now, next week, it'll be six days because we're going to try to get to it on a Friday. Yeah. But that's going to be de- fun down there. I didn't mow that last time, yeah, remember? I was going to say that. <laughs> so let's see how that goes. Wow. Look at the weed the boss just got. <laughs> this is ridiculous. <laughs> it was like growing up. I caught it out of the corner of my eye as I was looking at the hydrangea and how big they got. And, yes. That's ridiculous, man. That's a monster weed. You can tell this has gotten some We rain. got it right before it started to flower. Yeah. I think apparently you guys can eat this, right? Is really? It's called, like, wild lettuce. Okay, take something? a bite. No, I'm not going to. Do it for YouTube. No, thank you. Come on, man. <laughs> okay, let's get to work. So Rachel's working on that. I'm not done mowing everything. I mowed everything over here. I'm gonna start trimming. I still gotta mow the hill. I'll try to set you guys up all the way in the corner to watch us mow this. But I'm gonna go trim everything around the house first um, and take a break of mowing. Rachel's finishing up over there. She'll do the front. And then maybe I'll do the roadway. We'll see. She might do that. Okay, all is done around that way. I gotta edge this way, but. Rachel is doing all the hill right now. I'm going to go down here and start weed eating this way around this fence line. Then I just have to mow everything else down this hill. Then we will be done. So not much mowing. I tried to put you guys, set you guys up. nest up there. This is a fun hill, guys. And I'm just going to continue the lines. So let me finish edging what I need to edge. Rachel only mows so far. Maybe I'll take her mower. We'll see. (laughs) It's pretty steep. Right there, see?
Okay, I'm gonna go mess with this fence line. I thought I'd bring you guys to the bottom and show you. See how high of a hill is. Rich, Rich is up there somewhere blowing off. All I have left is this area right here, and we're done for the night. But I'm only doing one pass on this. We skipped it last time. The next time I'll stripe it up nicely. But let me get finished and we'll be done. Sorry, I was hot. The boss was hot. Uh -oh. It's not that bad out, but... There comes one of your minions. One of my minions? Really, man? So we're done. We're done. It's 6 o'clock on a Saturday. Yeah. We weren't going to work on Saturdays, but as you see, we did. Um, we needed to get that one done. Yeah. We, we still were a little bit behind from the rain, and... We thought that we got it yesterday, but did he get it? He got it. Who? Joe? Yeah. Yeah, Joe got rain. But the one we mowed last night, our last one, he after we put the fungicide and everything down, he said we didn't get uh, he didn't get one drop of rain. And right not even an eighth of a mile, probably mm -hmm. to the south of him more, the one we just mowed. Yeah. They got almost an inch of rain. It rained for three and a half hours there yesterday, but not not anywhere up this way. Crazy, you guys. Yeah. So, so well, that was a short video. Yeah. I got a quick question since we were talking about a project and landscaping. How many of you guys that just do lawn care are interested or trying to get into doing more landscaping? Yeah, that's a good one. Mm-hmm. I actually have another question too. Okay, so here's another one, guys. Have you guys, if obviously you wear headsets, um, but if you have music on, <laughs> have you ever forgot that you had the music on and then all of a sudden it connects again to Wi Fi or whatever, the internet? Because especially in these areas, sometimes it Wait, goes Wait, scared the heck out of you? Yes. Oh my gosh, you guys, I actually jumped. I really forgot that I had music on. And then it came on and I was like, whoa, what was that? I thought somebody was right behind me. Or I'll be in the garden with my headphones on. And Rachel's <laughs> yelling for me. And she doesn't realize I have my headphones oh, on. Oh, yeah. Right? Well, and especially because Carl doesn't have the best... Um, peripheral, peripheral vision. Peripheral, yeah, vision. So, like, I have to literally go up in front of him and be like, hey. He said somebody, she said to you last night, somebody could come out and hit you with a club, man. You <laughs> yeah. never know. Yeah, I was, like, walking around him for, like, five minutes. Yeah, because I probably went that way. You went around the tree. <laughs> I went that way. You went around. Yeah. But... 
So those are just a couple of things, but we are done and we appreciate you guys watching and all your comments and all that good stuff. So, so. once again, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And be happy. Or at least try. Have, Have a, a good, good night. night.